Hey guys, back with another Project Life update. These are weeks 13 through 15. So up here we're starting with March 25th through 31st. My first picture of the week is, oh, sorry, <laughs> is this pair of red born shoes. They are patent leather. They have an animal print inside and I just absolutely love them. Um, they are so uncomfortable and I don't care. <laughs> I wear them all the time even though they hurt my feet just because they are so cute. Oh and sorry don't mind all the boxes in the background back there I just got a, a shipment in for my business so those are just waiting to be unpacked. So over here is a picture of my blog passionatepriorities.com. Um, I'm really proud of my blog it's something I enjoy doing even though I'm not super consistent with it um, that is something that I'd like to get better on but um, I do love my blog so I wanted to post that and actually now um, I'm actually filming this video um, in June even though I'm filming March back here so I need to do an updated picture of this because I have changed my blog since this the layout and everything so I need to get an updated picture but then oh again don't mind my paper trimmer right here I'm just using it to hold my book up so I can get a, a better shot of this book for you so this is another just eBay update. Um, this is just on my seller page and it just shows, you know, over the last 7, 30, 90, and 120 days what your sales are. So over here for 120, I reached $30,000 in sales, which is absolutely amazing to me. Um, I have never in my wildest dreams imagined that I could achieve those kind of sales in a four month period. So. I just wanted to make sure and include that. And then over here is more eBay mess <laughs> because like I said, you know, when you do eBay, you have a mess. So there's a mess. And then just a little um, quote. And then down here, um, I finally got an iPhone in all its smudgy print glory there. Um, my husband is amazing and he loves to spoil me. He loves to show me um, affection and everything through giving me gifts, which works out great because I love gifts. <laughs> um, and usually he'll get me whatever I want. But with the iPhone, he did want me to wait a couple months to get it, uh, which I did. And this was the day that I finally got it. And I am absolutely in love with it. Um, I have a couple Apple products already. I have a, a MacBook and then uh, my Apple desktop, and then um, my iPod Touch. So I absolutely love Apple products. I was happy to add the iPhone to the collection. And then over here, I just, I loved this. Um, this Apple sticker actually came with my Mac, uh, with my, yeah, Mac desktop. Um, and I used it in my scrapbook instead because I loved it. All right, here is an overview of this week. This is April 1st through 7th. So up here we are starting with April Fool's Day. It was Sunday morning and I've said before in my videos that uh, my husband and I actually teach a Sunday school class at our church and we are lucky uh, that we get to teach the 7th graders and we get boys and girls. So our youngest son is actually in our class as well. But every week we bring the kids a snack and it's usually, you know, donuts or you know, Bojangles or, you know, just something, something fun and something bad for you. <laughs> so, um, on April Fool's, we told them that, um, we had had some complaints from parents that we weren't providing healthy options. So, uh, today their snack was going to be healthy. So we brought this crazy bowl. Here's a picture of it in the back of my car, but this crazy bowl of bell peppers and onions and jalapenos and cucumbers and carrots. And we passed them out, made all the kids take one and told them that was their snack for the day. And they absolutely looked at us like we had lost our minds. <laughs> but um, we ended up telling them that we were just teasing and we had brought Krispy Kreme donuts for them. So they were very happy. So this picture down here just kind of shows some of our kids that were there that day, um, you know, with their vegetables. And I'm not going to zoom in too much, um, you know, so I don't have to cover their faces. But uh, I really enjoyed teasing them. 
And then over here, have a picture of my son on our front porch. Um, I love my front porch. But he was just sitting here. We had a big return of dolls that needed to go back. And he was just waiting for the FedEx guy to get there and pick them up. And now this week again, um, this is just an eight and a half by 11 sheet protector. So I think it's kind of fun if you have extra pictures for the week or something, you know, you can just add these different size protectors and it, it just works. It's, it's a lot of fun and adds some dimension and interest to your album. Now on the back of it here are my kids. We went to a local uh, yogurt shop where you pick your flavor and then pick all your toppings and they charge you by the pound so there was just some pictures of that and then okay and then over here this is just on Saturday we went to see the movie Titanic as a family and again I didn't have any pictures from the actual movie or from us at the movie so I just captured these images offline so there's Titanic and just like a movie uh, poster that somebody had done and an advertisement for the movie <coughs> <clears throat> and an advertisement for the movie and then I included our tickets down there and that was 3D that was pretty fun seeing it in 3D all right and then this is week 15 and I switched over um, in the past couple weeks I've showed you but I just haven't updated it this is still basic gray up here up here sorry um, that is from the what collection is this it's from this woo, the sugared collection it's just fun um, I really like basic gray paper so far for this collection it's a lot of fun anyway this is Easter Sunday so after we got home from church there's my hubby we had a nice dinner of honey ham and mashed potatoes and green beans and stuff like that so it was really good and there's my kids with their Easter baskets <clears throat> and just a little sticker hippity hoppity Easter um, I don't know the company that made this it's just really old I've had it forever so um, I enjoyed using it and then over here on my journaling block is just this adorable little chickie coming out of an egg. Uh, this is just an embellishment that somebody made using, I think, a Quick Cuts die. And um, I bought it off eBay. Um, I'm creative and I can scrapbook and make all that kind of stuff, but I just fell in love with these, so I had to get them. I got a whole packet of them in different colors, so that was a lot of fun. And then over here's my hubby and I, um, that was our anniversary and we had been married 18 years on that day. So we have now spent more of our life together than we have apart, <laughs> which is pretty cool. And then there's my older son all curled up in his bed with one of the Hunger Games books. Now he's addicted. And I love this over here. It's the first time I got to use my Tim Holtz uh, washi tape, which you'll see making an appearance in the book more often now because I'm absolutely addicted now. And then here's my younger son, my older son and I at Chick-fil-A having breakfast together one morning. And again, here's washi tape. And then these letters are, they're like ghost letters. Um... I don't know. I forget what brand they are, but I got them from uh, Tuesday mornings for super cheap. And up here, these two pictures, there's my kitty again, and you can see what is he sitting on? My Project Life book. This is my desk that I scrapbook at. You can see my album here is laid out. He is actually sitting on top of my things that I'm trying to journal on. Crazy cat. And then when I said, you know, hey, what are you doing here? I get this look like you know what <laughs> I belong here so um, he's my scrapbook buddy and he doesn't make things easy to scrapbook but he sure is cute so I guess I'll deal with him and then down here is my adorable older son with pink bunny ears on his head at Target do not ever pass up the opportunity to catch your teenage sons being cute and goofy because they are so adorable and it is so worth it and someday I can use it for uh, blackmail or something if I need to 